Mafia segment is brought to you by South Louisiana Bank. It's better when we bank together. Weights and Downer, attorneys at law. Terrebonne Ford, built Ford Tough. Bye Time Sports is brought to you by Terrible General Health Systems Community Sports Institute in conjunction with Barker Honda. Hello and welcome to this edition of Bayou Time Sports. I'm your host, Keith Lysight, licensed clinical social worker. Thank you so much for joining us. However you may be joining us, we appreciate it. And you know, in the sports world, we always like to give you updates and things that are happening. There's always things that happen behind the scenes that we need to be excited about. Some of those things happen over at Nickel State University where we welcome in Shane Claybear. Thanks for joining us, man. Yes, sir. We appreciate it. Shane, first and foremost, before we talk about this new position, tell us a little bit about you. Well, I'm from uh, Vasher, Louisiana. Right. I attended St. James High School. I uh, was a student athlete there, uh, played football, earned an athletic scholarship to play at Nichols. Uh, so I'm a student athlete myself. And, okay. uh, you know, served almost two decades in education, uh, 19 years to be exact. Uh, my last eight years were in administration. Okay. I coached for 10 years of uh, football before going into administration. And I uh, decided to go in and uh, was the assistant principal okay. um, for six years. Right. And the last two years, I was principal. Um, and then within that time, we, uh, you know, we, we kind of turned things around at St. James and uh, we boasted 98 percent graduation rate. Remarkable. Uh, Congratulations, had, yes, by the sir, way. Appreciate that's that. That's a huge accomplishment. Yeah, we, we were at 68 percent. And, right. uh, you know, that's probably been the most gratifying part of uh, being a part of that change and just kind of saw a cultural change in that building and uh, in the community. Right. Well, yeah. Everybody, right, yes, sir. Kids, parents, yes. everybody gets affected by that. And, and so when I had the opportunity to uh, to kind of move on to Nichols, uh, it excited me. And, right. Uh, you know, getting back into athletics a little bit and working for JT, who was one of my former coaches, uh, was wow. an exciting opportunity. Sure. And so I'm going on just about a month okay. uh, on the job, and so I'm learning. And uh, but I'm excited. You know, right. I, uh, I'm energetic, and um, I'm ready for Nichols to uh, continue charging forward. Starting to move forward. I like it. Of course, Shane, congratulations, Director of Colonel Athletic Association. Uh, they call it CAA. Most people know it as such. Uh, but what what comprises the CAA? What what is it? So the CAA is the primary fundraising institution for Nichols Athletics. Okay. It's also um, for promotion of Nichols Athletics, and okay. uh, which is one of the things that I, I enjoy most is promotion and kind of getting athletics out there and events out there. Um, so that's primarily what it is. You know, it's there for promotion and also to help fundraise. Okay, uh, so. Nichols is part of the Southland Conference, of course. All of those two are always compared. How does Nichols relate as it, as it compares to other schools in the conference? So if you've been watching Nichols, uh, you know, championship-level performance. Right. Um, you know, we have championships in football and basketball and baseball, and those things have been uh, consistent. Yeah. And we have some great coaching at Nichols. Uh, we have some great leadership with Dr. Clune and also um, JT. Right. Um, you know, we're doing an excellent job there, consistently winning – um, you have some of the best facilities in the conference. Okay. You have some of the top education in the conference. Um, one of the things we also have is a low tuition. Right. Um, so it, it kind of works hand in hand. You have a, a top, you know, education at a low cost, but then we also want the lowest funded. So what comprises the CAA is myself, uh, the advisor board that I have, and also the members. So we're about 300 members strong. Wow. And, and that's where those members come in handy is trying to support where we lack. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Nichols is one of those uh, local universities that it really relies on the locale to make sure that we make ends meet sometime. Mm -hmm. And when you see the product that Nichols puts on the field, like I say, championship level performance, it requires championship level support. And that's what we're looking for with right. the CAA. Right. And, and, and I got to tell you, watching them in the Southland Conference in all of those different areas, watching, you know, baseball, softball, basketball, football, all of them really coming through very strong in that conference. And so, like you said, lowest funded, so we got to sometimes find a way to counteract that, and the community is a way to go about doing that, and that's what the CAA does. Uh, and so who do you guys fund, actually? So what we fund are primarily athletic scholarships. Okay. Uh, we fund uh, coaching supplements, salary supplements. Okay. We fund academics by way of tutoring. We also fund summer school uh, okay. and also operational expenses. So it says CAA can go a long way in the kind of making ends meet. Um, and, and that, you know, that comes from uh, some of our, our groups. Um, you can join the Huddle Up. 
which is specific to football. Okay. Um, and then you have the coaches committee. Um, those guys work hard. They cook for every team that comes in right. um, to Ben Meyer Diamond. And, and look, they cook for the home team. These guys cook for the away team. And then they also cook for their group. Um, on April 13th, we have the 74 baseball team coming in for the 50th anniversary. Oh, wow. And so the baseball committee is part of that with those guys. And we'll be honoring that 50th team. And, you know, it just you could you could not be successful without the help of these booster groups. That's part of CAA. Right. And what we have to offer. Right. right. So now speaking of, you know, not a lot of people are hearing this. They're looking at you and your excitement in this new role. How do other people get involved? Well, the first way you can get involved is by joining a CAA directly. Okay. So if you visit www.nichols.edu slash CAA, you can join one of six uh, different levels. And, of course, you would have incentives at every level, starting with, you know, attending home tailgates where you have your food and your drinks um, as part of your membership. And then as you go up in membership, of course, you might get a polo, and then you get a polo and a jacket. And then we have some gator coolers that we're partnering with for some of those levels. And that primarily goes to that scholarship fund those salary supplements. Okay. Also, if you'd like to join individually, let's say you join Huddle Up, you are a part of the CAA on that initial level at the varsity level, but you get those perks as a, a Huddle Up member as well. Okay. You, you get, get the chalk talks with Coach Rebo. Um, you know, you get your swag, your colonel right. swag, and you, you get your jacket, and you get the vest and all this good stuff. So you can continue to push the brand everywhere you go, people see it. Yeah. And again, uh, speaking of, you know, people see it, right? And this is yes, it, sir. which is really nice uh, to represent. And I was very glad uh, to be on campus and was very impressed with all of the Nichols paraphernalia that was yeah. out there. I mean, so much of Nichols represented and represented very well. And so glad to be on campus. I wore my red shirt. I wore my, my Nichols pin that I got. Uh, but congratulations to you. What I'd like to do is talk a whole lot more about this fundraiser coming up. Yes, sir. And so if you'll stick around, we'll do that. Yeah. All right. I appreciate it. Thank you, Shane. All right, guys, we're going to take a short break. Do that with us. We'll be right back with Shane Kleber about the CAA and how you can get involved. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Today's social media segment is brought to you by Terrebonne General Health System. Your health is our legacy. Rouse's, you're either local or you're not. Buick, the craft of modern luxury. St. Martin and Bork, know your rights. Bye Time Sports is brought to you by Terrible General Health Systems Community Sports Institute in conjunction with Barker Honda. Hello and welcome back to this edition of Bayou Time Sports. I'm your host, Keith Weissite, licensed clinical social worker. Thanks for joining us, however you may be joining us. As we welcome back to the program, of course, the director of Colonel Athletic Association, Shane Kleber. Shane, thanks again for joining us. Yes, sir. I don't want to call you executive director. We, we know it's important that the executives in our lives get, get their credibility, That's right. right? That's right. I love it. I love it. As both of our wives are executives and we're not. Uh, so talking a little bit about this new role that you have with the CAA and all of the involvement you're trying to do and bring to the community, only way we can really do it is by fundraisers, right? Let's talk a little bit about some of those events coming up. Yes, I mean, the easiest way you can get involved and the best way you can get involved is attending events, you know, and not okay. just attending games, but, you know, we have some a lot of events coming up. And look, Homa being 15 miles apart from Thibodeau. We're right know, there. Yeah, Nichols is not only um, Thibodeau's team, but it's also Homa's team. And it's Absolutely. really, it's Louisiana's team, you know, in that aspect. Well, I because like it. When you when you look at the local flavor uh, that Nichols has, I mean, you have more local talent on these rosters than you have across the state, yep. as well as across the nation. You know, you had 98 players on the football team last year that were from Louisiana. When you look at baseball and what they're doing in basketball, there's a young lady from Thibodeau that's going to be playing girls basketball next year. So right. just the local flavor is rich, and uh, we invite you guys to come out. One of the first events we have is the Seafood Extravaganza. Okay. And that's on um, April the 11th. That's Thursday. It's next Thursday, so we're just about next a week Thursday, away. Yeah. That's right um, there. There's still time to get some tickets. Okay. Um, really unique um, event has been going on for 22 years, and uh, it starts with a VIP reception where – you get a VIP gift. It's, this year it's going to be a, a custom etched uh, whiskey and wine glass with the oh Colonel my. logo. 
Wow. Uh, so you're getting some value there for the event. Right. You also have exclusive conversation with uh, Colonel's uh, Athletic Director, J.T. Terrell, right. and also the President, uh, Dr. Clune, right. as well as our head coaches. Mm -hmm. um, Dr. Mack is actually sponsoring our VIP presentation this year. And our events, uh, the title sponsor this year is Bayou Creations. Okay. Uh, wow. Quentin Sexton out of Homa. Yeah, yeah. Um, so once again, you know that Homa connection. And uh, once, once we have that VIP reception, We'll move over to the ballroom and actually have the main reception. We'll have a silent auction there. Okay. What's really unique about that auction is that you'll see items that you won't see at the local uh, academy. You know, okay. you'll see some unique items that are signed, and you might have a coach of the year uh, photo or some footballs and some helmets and that sort of thing. And then we move over to our live auction with some really cool items where you have a trip to uh, Sacramento State next year. Oh, that my. Is taken. So you right, can take right. that trip along with the team, and you right. can stay at the team hotel, and you can visit wow. you know, California while yeah, uh, no enjoying kidding. some Colonel uh, Caravan type of deal. Yeah, um, also, uh, we played a school out in Baton Rouge on September 7th uh, this coming year, and uh, that will be complete. There will be a package where you can visit transportation. Um, there's going to be tailgating. Okay. And there's also going to be access to a suite in Tiger Stadium. Oh, so my. That, that's actually also in the live auction. So those are some unique things. You have a golf um, outing with Coach Silva and Coach Rebo and JT and, and, and Coach Justin Lewis. And you can get out there and tee off with, with uh, some of the best. Right. Um, and also there's a meal with uh, Dr. Clune and JT. And that's, right. that's also right. prepared by our Chef John Falls Culinary Institute. So some really unique items, you know, that, that you have that you can get involved in. Um, we also have ZZ Loop will be there uh, with a gator, a live alligator okay. taking pictures and we'll wow. have some uh, interviewing going on. And you can kind of really connect with some of your uh, teammates and uh, fellow classmates of the past and some other fans. You know? Okay, very good. Jay, flash that back up if you don't mind. Again, it's April 11th. It is the 22nd annual Nichols Athletic Seafood Extravaganza. All the proceeds will benefit student athlete scholarships. It's going to start at 630. Uh, of course, uh, we're so very glad that Shane's been able to go through all those things. But if you want more tickets or opportunity for sponsorships, uh, visit go to www.nichols.edu backslash CAA backslash seafood. And uh, you can get a lot more information and get your tickets through it as well. I know you guys are doing that. Y'all do a lot of other things. Let's talk about something else y'all are doing with Big Mike's, kind of bridging that gap between home and Tim. Yeah, so uh, the Colonel Athletic Association, along with the uh, Nichols Foundation and also the Alumni Federation, sponsor a Colonel Caravan. And it's, okay. uh, it's a weekly visit to different cities. Um, we finish off with the World War II Museum in New Orleans on oh, August wow. the 1st. And in between Homer and that New Orleans caravan, we have Morgan City. We stop in the River Parishes, and we stop in Baton Rouge. But the first one on the on the map is going to be at Big Mike's Barbecue. You can mark your calendars for July the 1st. July 1st. Okay. And that's Big Mike's from 6 to 8, and uh, Quentin Sexton with Bayou Creations is actually sponsoring it. Okay. And we'll have some hors d'oeuvres at Big Mike's, and we'll have exclusive conversation with coaches and President Kloon again. Okay. And we'd like everybody in Homer to come out and, you know, support your home team for that right. event. And that's, uh, that's the Big Mike's in Thibodeau? Big Mike's in Homa. In Homa. Homa okay. Area. Very good. Yes, and sir. I'm glad we clarified yes. that because yes, it's going to make it easier. Yes. Again, that's that bridge to bridge the gap the between bridge. the two. Uh, and so that's Big Mike's in Homa on Barra Street. Yes, sir. And so you can come out again July 4, 1st. First. And uh, excited. Go ahead. July 1st, Big Mike's in Homa. Big uh, Mike's in Homa. Again. Uh, and I, I love the fact that we're, we're not that far away. And I think a lot of people learned that many, many years ago that now that we have the, uh, the couplet there between the two, 15 miles is not very far. And, you know, quite frankly, it it's so much shorter than going across big campuses, if you will, all over. And so home and Thibodeau are the same. And there's a lot to offer in Thibodeau. Nickel State University uh, has been the premier uh, college experience for people down here. And it's only getting better. And, uh, and I think you, you kind of feel that in your, your new role here for this last month. Absolutely. And that's what we're looking for, that championship-level support. Look, we have championship-level performance. You don't have to travel to see winning ball, you know, whether it's baseball, tennis, soccer. We have it all, and we're doing it on a championship level. Yeah, I love it. And uh, it's not just the sports, but it's the community, it's the experience, and it's making a difference for these kids. Shane, congratulations, and thanks for joining us today. Appreciate it. Thank you. You, you got it. All right, guys, that'll do it for this edition of Bayou Time Sports. Don't go anywhere. A whole lot more right here on HTV.